This is my granddaddy. See how nice and clean his tombstone is. This is the first man that held it down with Liz and Lou Ross Perkins. His name is Ali R.C. Ross. Born June 1st, 1911. Look at the date he passed. August the 31st, 1991. Yep, my granddaddy met my grandmother. Not long after he moved to Little Rock, Arkansas, they met at church. She was born in 1922. He was born in 1911. So you do the math. You tell me. Was he 10 years older than her or what? But I do know they died in the same month. She died at the beginning of August. He died at the end of August. God is so amazing. She died August 5th. He died August 31st. Yep. He born June 1st. A month before my birthday, July 1st. So that's why I'm so close to my grandparents because I have such a connection with him, my granddaddy, because I love him. He's the first of the month, baby, and so am I. I was born July 1st, 1978. That was the date that my mama gave birth to a star. Yep, for real. But I love you, granddaddy. I love you, granddaddy. It's my granddaddy. Ali R.C. Ross. And as you see, we love him too. We come and put Christmas flowers on his grave. My cousin just put these on here this morning. Sure did. Put them on here this morning. He got some red berries too. So we always pay attention to ours, baby, because we recognize what's more important in life. If we hadn't had these two wonderful people in our lives, we wouldn't be here to this day. Yeah, I'm talking about all them folks on my Facebook page that's relatives. I'm giving it up to all y'all. Shouts out to all y'all because y'all better recognize where you come from. I always recognize it. I always realize where I'm blessed, where I come from. You hear me? Because that blood right there, that blood, that blood right there, it runs deep. You hear me? That's a Cherokee, full Cherokee Indian man laying right here in this grave. My grandmother... He took her and made her a superstar. He sure did. She already had. How many kids, mama? How many kids that uh, grandma had before I see stepped into her life? See, they don't make them real like that no more. Men ain't even men no more. They, they don't even. She had seven or eight. She had how many? She had how many? Huh? Seven or eight children already. Yep, that woman had seven or eight kids already when this man first took her hand and said, I want you to be my awful wedded wife. <laughs> they really weren't married. They was common law married, but she still, you know what I'm saying? It don't get better than it. Me and Spine, you got one child this day, they like, they gone. They don't want no responsibilities, especially if it ain't theirs. They don't even want their responsibilities. So, you know, that's just the way of the world, though, you know what I'm saying? It's just how it rolls, but men don't come realer than this man. Not this day and time no more. Man, they know back then, men like Ali R.C. Ross, they held it down. You hear me? Like, real, for real, for real. My granddaddy was a lumber man. He worked for a tree service for 30-some years. Just like my daddy's daddy was a tree service man, worked for a tree service for 30-some years as well. So, that's why I love trees. I do. I love nature. I love trees because it's significant in my life. You hear me? My family love trees. This man right here was a lumberjack, a lumberman. Wasn't it, mama? Tree service. Tree service. Yeah. All right. Well, I see. I love you. I love you, granddad. How do you kiss you? I love you forever, ever, forever. I used to go to my granddad's house and steal like a dollar, two dollars. <laughs> I go through all his coat jackets. He know it too. He I done hit him up good. Brought him for all his change out of his pocket. He come back, he be like, I knew I had some change in that pocket. That's terrible. Take the change and go to the candy store. Just bad. How bad. But he didn't care. My granddaddy took care of me just like my grandmother did. So he used to love me. Send me to the corner store and buy peach pops. He loved some peach pops. Didn't he? Love some peach pops. But I love you, Ali R.C. Rawls. Merry Christmas to you. And much, much more. And bless you. 
God bless you like he blessed me when he made you. Glory to the Lord. Rest in peace, Eileen. You will one day see me. Both of y'all. I love you forever, forever, forever. You are my granddaddy, granddaddy, granddaddy. Want you forever, ever, ever. I love you, granddaddy. I'm a first of the month, baby, just like you. God blessed me.